Yeah, it was awesome. It was a really fast time, too, to see that kind of time this early in the season. It was really, really incredible. Now we switch disciplines. We go from the canoes to the kayaks. Same length. It's going to be 500 meters here. Some more Canadian representation from Paul Bryant in lane two. Seems Canadians are uh, stuck in lane two this morning. Women's K4 and men's C1. We've got good representation from the uh, former Eastern Bloc from two Belarusian crews, Russian, Russian crew, two Russian athletes. Yeah, Again, the, last, the last names are really difficult, so I'll just stick to Paul Bryant here <laughs> and Eric Loya from Germany. But with the exception of, of, uh, of two athletes in this final, it's pretty much all. Stockelov, he's block. obviously uh, got a bit of a bit of crazy. He actually won in the World Cup in Moscow in, uh, last year. What else has he done? He was uh, he came second in, uh, in Sega last weekend. Obviously, Marcin Kolbowski won that one. Yeah, a lot of big names in this, uh, in this final. Eric Loy is a fantastic C2 paddler from Germany. Uh, his, his father is his coach. They're off to a good start already. Athlete in lane six, Dimitri Yvarvar was a uh, judge the start very well on that. Lane six. Belarus seem to knock out these athletes uh, all the time, don't they? And even in uh, lane seven, uh, Dnez Haratza, he's actually won the, the World Championships a couple of times. And he's, uh, he's top. He's one of the C4 paddlers that have won the World Championships uh, so many times. But it's fairly even at the moment as they start. Fairly even, but you can see uh, lanes three and four are off to a fairly strong start. And I, I'm not surprised from Sergei Yemelyanov from Kazakhstan. Uh, Martin Fuchs, uh, he's, uh, he was a star of the under-23 Europeans last year. Czech Republic. Fortunately, I think he's just a little bit back. Or is he leading? I think it looks like from here. He's, he's, he's just a little bit back from lane six from Dimitri Navarvar. Oh, no, he's pulled up to the lead now. So we've got Martin Fuchs from Czech Republic in lane one. Great start from Paul Bryant in lane two. Should expect a strong finish from Paul from Canada in lane two. He's a thousand meter paddler, concentrates mostly on C2. I might have to take issue with the, uh, the, the halfway split there with Paul. Stokolov is making his move at the moment, but it's Fuska out in the front with 110 meters to go. Certainly wouldn't count out lane seven or lane six at this stage. Another 15 seconds of paddling. Ideal conditions. In front of his hometown crowd here. I think Martin Fuxo wants to put on a bit of a show for everybody, and he's certainly doing that indeed. Fantastic paddling. Last four or five strokes here, Martin. And he takes it. Well, it looks like Bello is coming. Second, I do think that was Dimitri. No, I'm sorry, that was Haraza. Haraza, I think, was in, was in second. And Kazakhstan, Sergei Yamoyanov. One, one of four Yamoyanovs competing. Is that right? Well, there's no doubt about the winner. So that's so far in the weekend. This is the third victory for the Czech Republic. Free beer, by the way, if, you, if, you, if you're in the area, you want to come down until, uh, until midday to celebrate the 100th anniversary of the, the Federation. Yeah, they had a few people uh, rather happy yesterday wandering around in the evening. <laughs> I suppose that's only legal in the Czech Republic, <laughs> seeing as it flows from the, the faucets. So Canada, you brought over quite a strong team. You seem to, seem to yesterday in the in the qualifications or Friday in the qualifications, you had a, a, a lot of guys up there in the finals. Is this yeah, we had some really good results yesterday. Um, you know, Mark Oldershot coming in fifth in C1 was fabulous, and also Jean-Bierre Beauchamp in seventh and um, Casey Fraser in K2 500. It was a really strong uh, silver medal finish. It was, it was really good to see. It's nice to see some strong performances from our women's team. Uh, we're always strong in women's canoe, and uh, very proud of our, our female canoeists. Uh, it's nice to make a final in K2000. Unfortunately, Brady and I uh, have a lot of work to do when it comes to the 1,000 meter K2. So you have our results. It's uh, the Czech Republic go from uh, Haratza, from Yemelyanov, and uh, Stokolev, who say, did well last week. He comes fourth. And